The Department of Mental Health is now under the authority of a federal management team. Visiting District Court Judge Consuelo Marshall has given the team all powers currently exercised by both the acting director of the Department of Mental Health and her staff. The team's duties and responsibilities include the power to hire and terminate staff, overseeing, supervising, and directing all financial, contractual, legal, and administrative functions, and the federal management team will report directly to the court and not to the current mental health director, Elizabeth Cruz, or to GovGuam. The Department of Mental Health will also pay all costs incurred in the implementation of the policies and decisions made by the federal management team. The members of the management team are the two court monitors, Dr. James Kiefer and Mr. James Casey. In reviewing the nine-year history of the case, Judge Marshall notes that the amended permanent injunction has not resulted in any significant and enduring reform. She also writes that recently she tried a different approach rather than issue wide sweeping orders, she tried to issue minute orders requiring the department to take concrete, discreet, and immediate steps. But not even that worked. Defendants have ignored many of the court's orders, she writes, and their compliance with others has languished. The amended permanent injunction is over six years old and defendants are no closer today to full implementation than they were several years ago, concludes the judge. Therefore, Judge Marshall says that the federal management team is necessary. That team has 60 days to come up with a plan of action. Judge Marshall's order specifically rejects a federal receivership, but the powers granted to the federal management team seem like a receivership in all but name. Kevin Kerrigan, PNC News.